Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading uh, for Libra. What are they hiding from you? What are they not telling you? Uh, for August 2022, you can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Uh, so we're going to take a look at the person that's on your mind or the person that you're dealing with. Uh, we're going to see what they're not telling you, what they're hiding from you, and then we'll finish off the read to see if... Um, if they will come clean towards you or if they will uh, or if, if you will find out uh, what they're hiding so apply this to your own unique situation switch the roles if you want keep in mind that these are general messages take what resonates and leave the rest behind uh, if this message didn't resonate with you take a look at your other placements even though this is love focused this could be with anyone this could be with a past person present person future person like I said, apply this to your own unique situation. If you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up, like this video, share this video, leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Libra people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading specific to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you book a private personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. All right, Libra, let's get started. Tell me about uh, the person that Libra is dealing with or the person that is on Libra's mind. What is this person hiding from Libra? What is this person not telling Libra? For August 2022, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Libra. Okay, let's get one more. the nine of pentacles virgo energy pre-empress energy and the seven of pentacles could be dealing with the virgo here you might have virgo in your chart too libra you know the star aquarius energy and the knight of wands i i i so i feel like this person sees you as their wish fulfillment the thing is i feel like this person is running away from it yeah it's, it seems like this person's trying to avoid you i because i'm feeling like this person feels like you might be too good for them or something like that or that they can't live up to your expectations okay uh, because you're coming up as a pre-empress and you, you're dealing with the knight of wands here aries legal sag aquarius energy with the star card tell me more we have a strength card, Leo energy. Whoever this is, this is an individual that's really sexually attracted to you. This person is kind of like lusting over you. This person is gushing over you and crushing over you, okay? Uh, but at the same time, I'm getting a very shy, timid energy, but I'm getting a very excited energy too, all right? Leo energy with the strength card, Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces here, all right? Seems like you might be dealing with someone here who could be younger than you. Uh, it doesn't have to be. It could be that this person's older than you, the same age as you, but they act very immature, okay? Uh, it seems like this person's very sweet, very fun, very adventurous. Tell me about this Nine of Pentacles. Why, the, why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? We have the Knight of Wands, the Seven of Pentacles, and the Chariot, Cancer Energy. Whoever this is, um, Libra, this person's all over the place. So Libra, I feel like you've been dealing with this person for quite a while because I feel like this person has been very in and out. It's like with the Seven of Pentacles, you're not waiting around for this person anymore. You're getting into your chariot and you're driving away. Tell me about the, tell me about the star card here. Why is the star card here? Why is the star card here? Why is the star card here? We have the Five of Pentacles. Tell me about the Knight of Wands. Whoever this is, this is an individual that's really insecure. You know, I feel like this individual, you know, sees you, you know, as such a secure individual and this person's not. And you feel like it's kind of like messing with this person in a way or that it's getting to this person. That's why this person doesn't feel like, uh, you know, they could compare to you or that, they, you know, they can't live up to your high standards or expectations here. Okay, the five of pentacles and the two of pentacles. It seems like this person doesn't know what they want what to decide. Could be a situation with the Knight of Wands here. This person could, could be comparing you to other people or juggling you with other people. 
it just seems like an energy of like this person's insecure because both of you guys are not on the same level okay the uh, strength card we have the ten of pentacles the uh page of cups and justice i mean we have some here that's eventually looking for marriage here you know, I feel like this individual strongly feels it, and perhaps you strongly felt it at some point, but I feel like you're just, you're just not waiting around for this individual. Libra energy with the Justice card could be dealing with another Libra here. Will this person come clean towards Libra, or will Libra find out what this person is hiding uh, from Libra? For August 2022, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Libra. We got the Seven of Cups and the Seven of Wands, okay. Six of Pentacles and the Six of Cups. It seems like you were dealing with this person for a long time. You might have even broken up with this individual, gotten back together, broken up and gotten back together, okay. Seven of Cups, Seven of Wands, Six of Pentacles and the Six of Cups, Seven, Seven, Six, Six, Four, Four. Hmm. Four of Wands and a Four of Pentacles. Whoever this is, I feel like someone here is hopeful that this can't come together. I, it seems like this person's pushing you, pushing you away, but I feel like at the same time, this person fantasizes about you a lot, daydreams about you a lot. Uh, also, you know, this could be an indication that this person's completely confusing the crap out of you. Uh, tell me about the uh, Seven of Cups. You know, the King of Swords. Tell me about the Seven of Wands. We have the Ace of Swords. You know, I feel like this person's gonna want to get something off their chest here. They want to, yeah. It's like there's a there's a back and forth here. They're gonna tell you how they feel, but I feel like you eventually, or that you have blocked this person. Uh, King of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles. Look at the Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. The Six of Cups. I feel like you're this feminine energy here. You know, I feel like you're having bad memory of, memories of this person just hurting you over and over again, breadcrumbing you. You just don't want to feel used anymore or be used anymore. This person could have put you in a third party situation. Like I said, this person could have been comparing you with other people, okay? It seems like this person, you know, it's kind of was having, uh, is ha wants you as a backup plan in case they find someone basically on the same level as them. The Four of Wands, why is the Four of Wands here? Tell me about this Four of Wands. This could be a twin flame connection here. It doesn't have to be. It just means that you guys might have a very, very, very strong soul tie. We have the Queen of Swords. We have the King to the Queen of Swords. The uh, Four of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles. Ugh. We have almost every single knight that is on the table. Yeah, um, on the table here. Uh, so uh, four knights are showing up. This is telling you that this person is very, very, very in and out. Very inconsistent here. Okay, seems like this person has one foot in the door, one foot out the door. I do feel like this person is going to, you know, come in to kind of make some waves, that sort of thing, sort of rock the boat sort of thing. Um, I do feel like this is a very dramatic individual here too. Um, so a lot of drama. Uh, I do feel like this is kind of like a soap opera in a way. Uh, so um, yeah, I do feel like this person is going to come back and make you like an offer here, but it might be too late. Yeah, because by that time you're already moved on or that you're in the process of moving on, okay? So uh, Libra, hope this was helpful. Hope this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I will speak to you guys in the next one. All right, thanks guys. Bye.